In this video, I will review how to use the Control Session button on Managed Service Tickets. This button creates and launches a remote support session from within a service ticket, and it can also create a time entry, attach a session report, add machine information to the notes, and more. Before I begin, the ConnectWise Control integration must be configured before this button can be used. A ConnectWise Control remote support license is also needed. To save some time, you should also sign into your control instance before you use the Control Session button. First, I navigate to the Service Desk module and select the Service Board screen. I use the Summary field to navigate to and select the ticket I would like to work on. On the Ticket tab, I click the Control Session button. From here, I copy the session URL. I can click Join Now to open the session window, but I'm going to return to Manage, click New Note, and paste the session URL to send to my contact. Once the contact joins the session, I'll see a new internal note in the ticket. This note contains a link for me to join the session, a preview link, and information about the contact's machine. I click the Preview Machine Information link, which opens a section of the control portal. Here, I can preview more machine information, add a note, chat with the contact, and more. This allows me to interact with the contact in case I can't join the session immediately. When I'm ready to control the contact's machine, I click Join Session from either the internal note or from the Control Session button. My browser prompts me to open the Control Application window, so I select the option to open, which begins my session. From here, the Control Host Client opens and I can control the contacts machine. Once I have finished, I close the window and select End the Session. Depending on how your administrator configured the integration, You'll see session information posted as internal notes, or as attachments, or both. For this example, I can see that a time entry has been created, session event and session connection information have been posted to the notes section, and I can view a report in the attachments tab. I have reviewed how to use the Control Session button on Service Ticket in Manage. For additional information about this process, please check out the University documentation. 